Hey guys, Penna Daily here, and welcome back to Let's Play Kirby's Epic Yarn. In the last episode, we squashed the Great Squashini, and now, and then took on Coco Station, the first of the bonus levels, and now we're taking on the second one, Dark Manor, which has an interesting gimmick and no Metamortex for once. Yeah. Yeah, the inside is dark. Only Kirby? And areas lit by either... These, um, lanterns... Or these glowing yarn balls are illuminated. And of course, we have ghosts. And lots and lots of secret areas. You're going to want to use the ghosts and the secret areas to find your way around. Ghost in a box. These toys can be pretty unpredictable and scary. If you wind up a ghost, they turn into one of those glowing balls of yarn. Yeah, I knew that was there, but the idea is usually that the beads... Yeah. Now we have um, these lanterns that light up as you... You know, when you pull on them, they light up and they slowly dim down. And then, I think that's pretty cool. Okay, can't get up there, but... That goes down. Okay, just checking. We get another yarn ball, which is good, because I use stars. And if we come up here and throw that up, we get that. Man, I hope I haven't missed. And there's a patch. If I've missed something, I'm gonna be, if I've missed the way up there, I'm gonna be really annoyed. Oh, it looks like I'm gonna be really annoyed. Where are you? There you are. Damn. Nope, I'm gonna have to make it another trip back through here. I somehow managed to miss the way up. Oh well. Yep. You can still whip underwater and carry. So that's pretty nice. We can come down here. And get some stuff in. And skip everything, but you can't get out. You're a dick, Flamer. So instead... 
You're such a dick. <sighs> Try this again. The other thing you can do is you feel like you've missed too much stuff. You can always uh, actually go back through. You can always restart a level. You don't have to finish it. Which I might have to do. We'll just see. And of course, we come up this way. There's... Okay. Come down that way, and we get our five star patch, and that's nice. Okay. Oh, hi, guys. Well, that wasn't what I wanted to do. No, ghosts are not bothered by light. Looking for, you know, anything I might have missed because, like that, I knew I had missed something. I mean, we're still also, yep, the Dark Manor music, that's fine, and now we go down, and now we can actually leave, and I'll just come back in, and I'll sh show you what we... I'll show you what I, um, didn't get in the first thing. You do have to beat the level with a... You can't quit once you get a treasure, I don't think. Maybe, maybe you do, but maybe you can. I'm not sure. I'm not going to try it now. Not bad. All right, I will be back. Um, well, no, I'm just going to go right in, and then I'll quit after we get the other treasure. Let's try this again. I do like this level. I think it's a really great gimmick, even if it does mean that I missed a treasure. That one we've already got, obviously. So I'm just gonna move on. Okay. Ha! 
See, I knew. I knew it. Just, yeah. This pumpkin looks great as a quaint decorative item. Until it rots, I assume. Okay, anyway, I'm going to, um... Get out of here, and I will see you guys back on the map, so. And we're back. Okay, so I got that, obviously. And now we can go into... You could actually follow that right off the edge of the screen, but we'll walk the normal way. Let's take on the first level of Waterland, since we've got... 10 minutes left. Splash Beach. <clears throat> Pardon me. I beg your pardon. So it's basically pre dawn at the beach, which is what a lot of surfers tend to. Uh, <laughs> That guy is a sawgill. They're a little nasty. And of course, the beach has tides. And you're down here. Nope, we also have a snip snap. But it leads us to this. We have stacked turtles, so you can't get past them because the clouds come down and you just can't. You have to go this way. We have a bunch of waddle dees sleeping together like birds. And a patch. Yeah, I love how it turns, the patch turns the moon, the sleeping moon, into the sun. And it's morning! Morning at the beach. And everybody's awake. Alright, and then of course... Not what I wanted to do, but okay. Fine. Be that way. And as you can see, the turtles are awake and moving. They are no longer yurtling. Yeah. To anyone who does like Dr. Seuss, uh, I suggest that if you have never read Yurtle the Turtle, you really should. It's one of my favorites for a few reasons. And that there is more than one reason people have occasionally called Mitch McConnell that. You can flip these open, and they make... Uh, what's the word I'm looking for? Platforms. They are only temporary platforms, however. So if you stand here and wait... You can... You can whip those dudes as they come past. Or you can just do it that way, but yeah. Let's see if we can get to it before any of it goes away. We can. Good. If we drop down here, there's nothing. It's just basically... Sun clock. The sunny clock gives off a warm glow. Ah. It is rather nice, isn't it? Now you wait. And... Okay, fine. We'll do it the other way. I'll take that, thank you. And you can die.
that up, jump up there, jump up here, and... Yeah, you cannot actually um, whip them from a direction... That probably wasn't the smartest, oh well. There we go. Moon clock. This moon clock gives off a gentle light and goes dark once a month. Nice. And... Yeah. I do like the tide mechanic in this level. It's fun and interesting. And now we have a plastic raft. Make sure you don't let him pop the plastic raft. Get on the raft while it's down there, and you can jump over here. Wait for it. star patch. Wait for them to go by again. And I'm just going to ignore the rest of those beads because I don't like living dangerously. Is this bit again? Oh, right. Yeah, first level. I'll finish this off. Yeah. Wait till they go down, otherwise you will hurt yourself because that rope drops. And I don't think this is actually how uh, waves work, but who am I to argue? And there we go. And we get... Secret Island. This new music plays in Secret Island. Where's Secret Island? It's later. We'll deal with it. But I guess this music we already have, so... Sure. Now I get a five-star rank. Except I don't. I get three. Oh, well. That's fine. And we get the whistle. I like this. I think you're gonna like it too. Got all the treasures. The whistle patch. Yeah, yeah, I don't care, Beedrix. Though, we could... You know what? I'm gonna... Throw this. We're gonna go back and... Um, well, no. At the beginning of the next episode, I will go back to Quilty Court. Blub blub ocean. Okay, then. At the beginning of the next episode, I'm going to go back to Quilty Court, and we'll do that last room, because we can do that now. But this is where we're going to call it for now. So thank you guys for joining me for Let's Play Kirby's Epic Yarn, and I will see you next time. Have a great evening. Goodbye. <laughs>